What's up, y'all? It's Teacher, and we have the Indigo Disc. I've downloaded every secret in the game into this. Terrapagus, every mystery you've ever wondered, we about to solve. If y'all are watching this with me, bless your heart. Shank that like button for the first episode. Let's get like 6K likes. Y'all, it's beginning. <laughs> Let's go. I get in a call. I wonder. Uh, Clavo. Hey, this is so nostalgic, y'all. This is Clavo. Do I have the pleasure of speaking with Master Tamo? Look, y'all, we hopping right in. I got stuff to show you, by the way. Uh, yep, that's me. Oh, this music. My, my. It certainly does this old heart good to be treated with such a lively response. Damn, you're gonna call your own heart old sucker? You're gonna die so early if you say that. Wow, why do I start like that? Now, if I could take but a moment of your time, there's something we must discuss. Master Damo, you're about to be presented with an exceptional opportunity that costed $40. We go in a Unova, boys. <laughs> you already know of the Unova region's Blueberry Academy, I presume? <laughs> Who's that? Clavo, it's really cold. Can I go inside? Oh, now this is a surprise. I had heard you were taking part in our joint trip with that fine school. In any case, the director of Blueberry Academy happens to be an old friend of mine. And he told me that he would be delighted to host you as an exchange student at his school. Why? I believe it would be a fine chance for you to learn even more about the world. One should always take advantage of new challenges like this, don't you think? Though I must confess, I am in love with you. So, oh my god, can you just commentate normally? I was a bit surprised that Blueberry's director would specify you by name. Saka, like he's in love with me. Still, <laughs> I think it's best that you meet the man. <laughs> I have to date him? At least, can you... I won't do it again. At least once to find out what he might be taking. <laughs> Before you put a ring on it. This is so bad. He's admittedly a bit of a character. But not to worry. I'll be there when you meet him. <laughs> my emergency phone call. Uh, once you feel ready to respond to his offer. I ask that you come by my office so we can discuss the specifics together. So yeah. This is a fresh new game. I just did the Academy Ace Tournament. Beat the Teal Mask. So I got a couple things to tell you. I can tell you exactly what leads into this DLC. When you finish the Teal Mask, Briar, Carmine, and Kieran say they have to leave early because there's some developments concerning the Great Crater. We forgot this, but this is actually how the Teal Mask ends. So Blueberry, they're they're sneaking their hands on the Great Crater, it looks like. Cause no one's Sucka you! Cause they're not allowed in the Great Crater. Briar tries to go, but she's not allowed. Uh hmm, who do we have here? I know I've seen your face somewhere before. Who are you again? I'm Tamo. How old do you think he is? 47? Oh, that's right. You're Tamo. Yes, yes, I know you. I'm a champion. Well, now. Now that you're here, let's get going. Wait. Wait just a moment, Director Cyrano. Hey, blue and purple. Oh, hello there, Veli. Oh! <laughs> What's your first name, Elizabeth? You're as lively as always. Veli, Clavo. Maybe his name's just Veli. You're as lively as always. Didn't realize you were here. Of course I'm here as director of this academy. Where else would I be? And you address me more properly while students are present. <laughs> Look at his face. Y'all, I'm so hyped and happy. More importantly, what are you doing out here? I thought we'd agreed to meet in my office. Did we? Damn, this guy has rainbow eyes. Must have slipped my mind. Anyway, why, why does it matter? This is the student, right? Well, yes, he is, but... Uh, I do apologize, Master Tamo. You must be terribly confused. This is Director Cyrano of Blueberry Academy. As I mentioned on the phone, he's interested in accepting you as an exchange student. You know what's crazy? So this man, he's, he's Univin. That's interesting. Yep, that's me, Director Cyrano. Er, did I not mention that? One look at our young friend here <laughs> makes me suspect you indeed failed to clarify that point. Speaking of which, why are you so old, Clavel? I mean, you have such white hair. Look at that. Speaking of which, why did you request Master Thamel specifically to take part in your exchange program? Excellent question, Valley. <laughs> it's very simple. You see, the reason is... I'm balding. Shouldn't you just... Uh, hmm. Why did I put in that request? What an interesting design. Oh, that's right. The school trip to Kitakami. Damo met some of my students there, didn't he? It sounds like his excuse here is a lie. His reasoning. 
Yes, yes. One of them was named Carmine, I believe. Aw, oh, I'll tell you all about this. She's the one who recommended you. Now that I've gotten to meet you for myself, yeah, I've got a good feeling about you. Oh, ho, I'm glad to hear that, Director Cyrano. Look, it's Toro back there. I'd just love for you to visit my school. You would be a breath of fresh air, so to speak. Well, if anything can be said about Director Cyrano, it's that he has a keen eye for talent. I would be thrilled if you went to Unova and got to know the students there, but only if you're willing to, of course. Think of it as a chance to further expand upon your treasure hunt. Literally, it is, y'all. I wish I could accompany Master Tamo, but I'm afraid I must ask you to watch over him in my steed. You will watch over him, won't you? I refuse, Veli. Oh, of course, I'd never let anything happen to one of your students. I hope this experience leads you to even more you can treasure. Best of luck to you. Clive, can you please sneak in as Clive? Why can't someone, assistant, direct, uh, just give me a holler? Whenever, the sucker's Univan. He just spoke American to me. Y'all, so, Carmine, I have this fear that Carmine, I mean, we're gonna have to see in Blueberry, but she might not have any friends at Blueberry Academy. Cause she was really sad to say goodbye to us in the teal mask. Uh, are you all ready to kick your studies abroad at Blueberry Academy? Yes, sir. Like, really sad. Great, then let's get going. Damn, style. It sounds like she really treasured you, and it makes you think, like, do you not have friends at Blueberry? Could you imagine she's just as alone as Karen? Y'all, I'm the the- We're going to Unova! I'm the theory god, y'all. The moment suspicious dialogue pops up, I'm gonna hit y'all with the theories. Part two. I can't believe this is happening. Will y'all believe if I had a dream I was playing this, and then I woke up? It was a one hour alarm, y'all. But I dreamt I was playing for a long ass time. Indigo disc, baby. Guys, every mystery we about to uncover. We in Unova. Ta-da, we're here. Can I please change my clothes? Welcome to my Grand Blueberry Academy. Do I recognize this music? Is this Univan music? Like Entralink music or something? This is actually just the entrance. The school itself is mostly underwater. Isn't that amazing? Oh, and did you notice? Look at how blue the place is. I can't tell you how long I spent picking the perfect blueberry color. <laughs> Let's see. What else? I think he has a different reason for calling us here. No, no, no he doesn't. The Carmine reason makes sense. Uh, perhaps you have something you'll like to ask me? Um, how do you know? I don't care about the school being underwater. How do you know Director Clavo? Really? That's what you're curious about? Well, it's very simple. You see, it's, uh... No! Director Cyrano and Director... Oh, she's telling us. And, and Director Clavo got to know each other through their postgraduate work at the same university. <laughs> we have universities in this? Or at least that's what I've heard. Uh, yes, right. Exactly. Took the words right out of my mouth. Is he forgetful? Always on point, aren't you, Lacey? Oh no, it was nothing. Do we have a guest today? We do. Tamo here is part of the exchange program. Make him feel welcome, hey? Hold on. This is the exchange student from the Paldia region so far away. Hello, trench coat. I suppose I didn't introduce myself, did I? I'm Lacey. One of the second year students here. Darn. Imagine going to school here. You must really be something special, you know. It's rare for Director Cyrano to remember the name of a new student. He is forgetful. Ah, just call me out, why don't you? Actually, I've got an idea. Why don't you explain how things work around your Lacey? You want me to do it? Yeah, well, yeah. You know, this tour guide stuff isn't my strong suit. Well, that certainly is true. But still, I imagine there must be someone more suitable than me. Why is she so sad? Look at her. Oh, please don't take it like, it's not that I don't want to show you around or anything. Director Cyrano just has this bad habit of pushing his duties onto me, you see. And it's just not right. Look at that. That's an emote right there. Really letting me have it today, aren't you? That said, this might be my chance to get to know the new student everyone's talking about before anyone else can. Yo, Carmine been spreading my name. That decides it. I will take on this task. Excellent. Give me clothes, Lacey. Now then, let's head straight down this bridge and to the entrance. On you go. 
Whoa, we playing. Can I open the map? Oh, this is. Okay, I'm like, what the frick is this? This is the terrarium. Yo, look how circular it is. Could it? So this is a theory, right? That this entire terrarium, you see how it's walled too? There's a theory that it's inside a freaking Pokeball. That we go into a Pokeball to get inside. Let's see. Uh, get this. That barbecue I did. No, Blueberry Quest. Frick. I got you guys. Um, I can't believe it. I wonder if we're near that underwater tunnel uh, in Unova. The Polar Bar, I'm sure, is cold. Where's my next class again? This is wild. Stop. Can I can't read it. You got to battle more. My Pokemon won't evolve. This is a crazy... You got a Torchic? Hi. Hey, welcome to Blueberry Academy. It's pretty wild. Uh, the first time you come to school by riding a subway to an undersea elevator, huh? I didn't see all that. They off-screened it. Wanna get... What? Oh. That's crazy. Okay. Like, how, what's the other side of this? Let me see the other side of this. What the fr... Okay, that's the elevator we took up. Yeah, yeah I mean... Okay, you know what? I mean, let's just... I can't ride Mariah on here. Okay, let's just get to a place and then I'll start with freaking speculating and stuff. So, where does she want me to go? Oh, yeah, we gotta go to the front entrance. Oh, man, I'm gonna be late. Y'all got school? This ain't school. I mean, it is a school. Need more balls. Y'all gotta chill. Ack, I forgot something. I wish I had more BP. You've only got one Pokemon that can battle. Okay, y'all, y'all! <laughs> I need two Pokemon? Yeah, what are you doing to those executes? Yo, you want to see my team? Step, don't do that. Do this. It's just Ogi. <laughs> I have a fresh slate. But I'm going to show y'all what we can prepare since they want us to have another member. So check it out. No, don't look yet. Frick. Okay. <laughs> I have two members that. So Ogi is only level 76. But I decided these are my two favorite Paradox Pokemon. So I got them prepared. We got Rudolph's Sun, uh, Iron Bundle, and then Scrunchy, which I caught in my Scarlet playthrough. They're both level high 80s because I've been told, apparently this DLC is extremely difficult. So, you know, Oki's not going to be able to handle it on her own. But I got something else for y'all. So, I either pick these two, or I can pick what's in the next box. Which is Baby Spice the Enamorous. <laughs> So she I gave it an ability patch. So it has its hidden ability contrary and well, let's just have the all-girl team Ogi and baby spice. So I want to use this uh, Because we never get to use enamorous y'all like it's only in legends Arceus and It has its signature move spring tide storm. Look at that So, you know what this is what we're gonna do these are gonna be our two Pokemon fresh slate and also the can I can Ogi follow me? Um, the fire mask is my favorite, so that's what I'm using. A fire grass type is so sick. Come on, give me some Univan lore. And some clothes, please. This is the entrance to Blueberry Academy. Our school puts a great deal of emphasis on the art of Pokemon battling. That's crazy. It makes us sound like these guys can all whoop Gita. We hold official matches on this central court right here at the entrance. And any student can freely utilize this court if it's not otherwise in use. I think it's safe to say that you'll be battling more here than in any other school. Exactly. You couldn't have said it. I know you weren't listening. Director Serrano, I think <laughs> perhaps it's fine if you just leave the tour to me. <laughs> Still, it's really relaxing here with the sea breeze blowing over you. Even when no one's battling, you often see students lazing about in the stands. Ah, oh, I would too. That's a vibe, man. Oh, 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 and there's one other quality of our school that you'll likely find very surprising. Wild Pokemon sometimes terastalize here. There we go. So, this place is affected by Tropicus Energy. Really? This is big news. Oh, I suppose that's not anything special to someone from Paldia, is it? The terastal phenomenon was first discovered in the Paldia region after all. So now two other places have it. Kitakami region and this weird academy. But we've taken things a step further than you and your Terra Orbs. We've developed some neat tech ourselves. Something that lets us control the terrestrial phenomenon on our own turf. I bet that piques your interest, doesn't it? What does that mean? No. 
I'm sorry, Strona. I have to. I'm sure. I think it will be easier to understand how all that works after we go to the lower level. If you could put a little pin in that thought. Oh, he's thinking ahead. That's her lacy. Oh, you know what? I think it'd be great if the two of you had a battle. She's an elite four. Why not? I'd like to see what Tamahir is capable of. Wow, they're going to drop it now? And Lacey is a member of the Elite Four in the league club we have going on here. Okay, so it's a university. <gasps> to say nothing of the influence of her father, one of the Unova region's famed gym leaders. Yo! I bet you'll learn a thing or two. I wish you wouldn't go spreading personal information without asking first. It's just not right. Give me a good show now, you two. I'm sorry, but there's no negotiating with Director Serrano once he's... This is so cool. Once he gets a head in his head. Hide. Something. There's no way we'll move on with the tour until we've given him his battle. Besides, I have to admit, I'm a little excited myself at the chance to battle you. Black me out, Lacey. Here at Blueberry Academy, we tend to go for double battles. How dare you. Okay, Lacey, don't be sexist. Treat the two girls on my team with respect. Of a music! This is wild! What happened to my hair? This is crazy, Lacey Macy! Hit me with that two time Tracy! Go, baby spice and posh spice! What level are y'all? I suppose I'm representing Blueberry Academy in this battle. I'll try not to disappoint you heavens with this jukebox boombox. Oh my goodness, so what did they mean? Okay, level 70s, y'all see, look, that's kind of wild though, bro. What the frick is going on here? Y'all, can you imagine, so these are the moves. Can you imagine enamors can learn baby spite outrage? I want to see this move. See, Ronald's freaking watching. Yo, I knew it. It's all Univin music. As if they couldn't. This is so perfect for the DLC, y'all. Unlike the teal, unlike the Isle of Armor and um, Crown Tundra, this one is leading. This cannot be more obvious. It's leading into Unova being revisited. What's Lacey doing over there? Yo, Ogre Pun is so cool, dude. Look. Can, like, look at Ogre Pun, right? It doesn't have a crown. It's very peculiar, and we'll talk about this more, but Ogrepon doesn't get a crown. Ogrepon just leveled up. Did you just do this to Baby Spice? Looks like my plus minus strategy isn't working. You're the first person in history to do that. Ain't no one make use of plus. She have more po Her father's clay. I don't even know who clay is, but her father's clay. Okay, I know who he is. Uh, Mystical Fire hits both, right? I'll just use this again. Clay is the guy who- I can't believe it's- You killed Posh Spice! Kogita's rolling in her immortal grave. Alright. Treat Ogi with respect, Plusso. I thought I would have a focus sash. Oh, would you look at that? You go right after those type weaknesses. Okay, yeah. So, yeah, it's an Elite Four, but it's their university, or is this university? It's their school club that they're the Elite Four of, which doesn't lower what that means. Look, this is a tough, like, this is a close battle. I'm faster, though. It doesn't reduce the weight of them being an Elite Four member, but I guess that puts them realistically in terms of the overall Unova power scaling. It puts them out like gym leader level. Because these are still a bunch of school students. I can't believe Baby Spice died. Well, you beat me soundly. So cool, y'all. Oh, Unova. First went to Japan and now we're in Unova? Spectacular. You really are quite skilled. And the way you terrestrialize your... Let's go, I unlock dialogue. I can see that living in the home of the Trastle phenomenon taught you much. That's so cool, bro. Paul, they got respect. The students here at Blueberry Academy were only recently issued terror orbs. So I hope you'll be able to teach us more about them. Yeah, they were only invented 10 years ago by Sadan Toro. Well done to both of you. You really battled it out Blueberry style. Speaking of style, 
Thank you. Give me clothes. I'm nude. And you know how cold it must... I am beautiful. And tight. It suits you perfectly. Can I get the big sweater too? Now that's what I call fashion. Oh, and you can take a sweater. I hope I can buy a sweater with this. I'm, I have to go. Wait, my hair is effed up. I have to go right now. Now that you look the part and hopefully feel it too, why don't we head into the school? You can pick where you want to go. Wait. Could the school be in the terrarium? I thought it was separate. Come on, I can show you the pride of Blueberry Academy, our world-famous terrarium. Okay, y'all, we're getting the lore. Can I go up here? Oh, yes! Is Posh Spice still dead? This is so cool. Y'all, I thought it was a school on the top floor. That's sweet. Try the Savannah biome, I don't get it. I just can't get my head around rock material- rock type studies too. Okay, so their courses aren't history, you know. It's- What did you see? The Trestle? <gasps> you guys are changing your dialogue? This is very cool. Whoa, you should see how packed the seats get when there's a championship match. What are you eating? I don't know, okay. You better stop eating it then. What are you looking up at? Are you okay? Look at the wild sea. I can't believe it, y'all. This is Unova. I'm like playing black and white right now. Let's hit up the camp. Can someone take me to the indigo? Let me in the stands. Come on, let's head back. Are you eating? Oh no, you're studying. I get that. Wait, yeah, that makes me depressed. Get away from that. I will talk to you. You look so nice. She got the Kieran bang. Welcome to Blueberry Academy. I wanted to talk to you more. I don't want to talk to you. Where do you want to go? Terrarium. So y'all look, there's four sections and then a center section. Okay, that's where the class is. Oh, no, 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 look. The, f the, the sections you see in the middle, those are different school classrooms. Wild. At least that's what I think. My mind is blowing, y'all. This is so cool. Blueberry Academy, is that what it says? And I mean, well named and everything, you know, they didn't F up. It was teased because it's called Blueberry Academy and not what it should be called in Spanish. It was a teaser that whatever Blueberry Academy was in, it was an English region. So gather or Unova and it was. So let's forget about the Pokeball idea for now. This is just wild right now. Bro, these pants are too tight. My freaking butt hurts looking at that. Look at the ambience. This is it. The park beneath the sea that has gained renown around the world. Our very own terrarium. How beautiful. Look, all those dense teropagus energy, y'all. How? We may be underwater, but the projectors built into the walls and ceiling make it feel like we're actually outside, don't they? All right, so you've kidnapped the Lolan Executor and you've taken away their sunlight and given them fake sunlight. These suckers gonna die. We've been able to create a comfortable environment for Pokemon through technology. I designed all this myself. How? And believe me, it wasn't cheap. Within the stone, <laughs> we ignore him. <laughs> Within the stone, there are four distinct biomes. Here we have the nice and toasty subtropical savanna biome. Very lagging or something. Then, off to your right, you can see the breezy tropical coastal biome. Look like a Lola, dude. Further out to your left, you see the craggy, crunchy, rugged, scrang canyon biome. Ooh, last but not least, way out in the distance, we have the arctic and snowy polar biome. Each biome's air temperature and humidity levels are regulated with the utmost care. That's why you can find completely different Pokemon species living in each area. We sure put a lot of effort into it. Yo! I think we're ignoring him, y'all. That's so funny. Tell me, Tayom. Tamo, which biome tickles your fancy? The tropical one. Goodness, really? It seems you and I will get along just great. Then, that's my favorite too. Are you lying? The breezy atmosphere is just so calming. If you need to heal up the team while you're down here, feel free to use the self-serving healing. Then why is that guy there? He's gonna kidnap me. Now then, Director Cyrano. Yes, this is good. Can you explain to us why crystals form here, and how the wild Pokemon are able to terrestrialize? 
Uh-huh. But don't you know already, Lacey, that... Oh, I get it. You want me to do the talking. In that case, let me show you. The reason is actually right above our heads. So, okay, is Tarapagus in there? <laughs> That's the crap from the anime. That over there is the Terrarium Core, which presides over all that happens in the Terrarium. Yo, there's Terrapagus Ju- Is something in- Yo, something is in there. Like a giant crystal. Siron, you freaking found Terrapagus and kidnapped- Look, you can see hexagon cells floating. It contains a fluid that we've jam-packed full of a special material from Polia. This is all science. It's constantly emitting terrestrial energy. That's what allows Pokemon to terrestrialize in the dome. Wonderful. Well said, sir. That's exactly right. Though, I still don't know what that special material... The special material is Terrapagus. <laughs> ...is within the Terrarium Core itself. It's never been shared publicly, has it? Oh, you want to know? Okay, so she asked that. You want to know? Well, in fact, it's... It's... He doesn't know. Now, what was it? I've plum forgotten. Briar... Briar put all of it together, so I'm not certain myself. That's what I thought you might say. Briar? <laughs> Practical battle class will commence shortly in the coastal biome. Students participating in this class should make their way to the coastal biome now. Lacey, that's you. Bounce. Oh, it looks like you're just in time to see a class. I don't want to go to class. This is too good a chance to pass up. Won't you join us, Damn what You can get your first taste of class. But, but it's such a great opportunity to learn. Take me to Carmine. I freaking miss her. I'll go ahead and register the Terraria map to your Rotom phone for you. Damn, look at that phone case. It's fun to take a stroll through the Terrarium on your own, and I think it'd be more of a hassle than anything if you had me holding your hand. So, yep, that settles it. Please find your way to the class site in the coastal biome on your own. Well, it doesn't seem like I'm needed here. Wait, sir, you don't. But I've made sure that our dorm room has been all set up for you, Tamo. So don't forget to give it a visit later. I'm skipping class and going there now. It's got a white phone case. Oh yes, and one other thing. Could you open your Pokedex app for me? Nasa, this is my information. He just hacked me. Blueberry decks, a bunch of national decks returning. Catch as many Pokemon here in the Terrarium. I bet I need to, to unlock some crap. It's your student life here at Blueberry Academy. So remember to live it up to the fullest. I don't think he's shady. He's far too forgetful. And there he goes. I got nail polish on all of a sudden? What did you do to me, Lacey? Well, you can at least count on me to be around when you don't need me. When you need me. So there's no call for concern. It's probably time we both head to class. How dare you rope me into this? I've been railroaded. In a place with no tracks. Hi, Lacey, can I just meet Carmine? Yo, Carmine was like the way she says goodbye to you in the teal mask. I have to, I have to see if she has any friends here. Could you imagine she's just as lonely as Kieran? And maybe it's because of her like personality. You know, she's very. What do you even say? Wait, hey, who did you just rob? Oh my goodness, it's Kanto. It's actually Ka sucker. What do you want? No. <laughs> Kill him. Yo, yo, where's that Tropicus Dome? There's something wrong in this world. <laughs> Hell no, all I got is Okey Pokey. Yo, this is crazy. Execute, so this is where the dudes got it. Whoa, man. It's so, it's definitely so weird to see a bunch of Kanto Pokemon. Kill me, Rhyhorn, I wanna die. Okay, look, we got a little station here. Let's see if we can figure out what these blocks are. Wait, please. Yes, baby! Ah! This is amazing. Let me climb the walls. Let me get to Torbogus right now. Climb the walls! He won't climb. That's suspicious. Leave me alone, Dodrio. What level do you think the Dodrio is? This is amazing. Yeah, so they don't let you climb the walls. 
No, I ain't gonna say it. I ain't gonna say crap. Okay. So, okay, more Dodrios here. Is that a trainer I just saw? Sucker, get to class. You can't skip. So much mud. Are you- You are a tra- I shouldn't have done this. Playing in the mud is the best, right? I hope you get hit in the face? Wait, so that wasn't Lacey's theme or a uh, Blueberry Academy theme. It's just the trainer battle theme here. You live in Pokemon? I can't believe it, dude. Yo, I'm so proud of you, Game Freak, man. They getting real creative making it Univin music here. When was the last time we really had this? I guess it was when we went to Johto after Kanto and the music. Oh, Kanto after Johto and all the music was completely dead. Level 70 freaking four? Okay, I gotta. What do I gotta do? I'm not trustalizing. I'll just low kick the big one and then I'll. Thank you, I want it out of this battle. So, yeah, this is just my team. If the trainer starts to get hard, maybe I'll grab my paradoxes. Isn't that weird, y'all? Those are my favorite two paradoxes. The little tiny ones. Yeah, Ogi's level 77. We're good so far. You got more Pokemon? Is that Rhyhorn yours? It's oh, God. You had the whole... He's already dead? Oh. Oh, contrary, y'all. Why didn't I give it contrary moves? That probably would have helped. All right. I mean, you probably... Oh, okay, that's the problem with this movie. I'll have like 85 accuracy. Don't touch Ogi. You're really giving me trouble. I like this though. Level 75, y'all. This is legit. I bet you Ivy Cudgel does more. Uh, you know what? No, I'll just do this. It'll, it'll land this time. I'm, I'm just not going to look at the screen. I legit just want to do a bunch of trainer battles, but I won't. I want, I want to get to the story. Can you stop harming the baby? Are you seriously not? Oh, it's because I'm missing. I'm legit releasing you, you granny. Look at her white ass hair. I thought you were the coolest Pokemon when I set you up. You know what? I'm going to aim at baby spice now. I'm going to Ivy cudgel baby spice. And then I'm gonna spring tide storm. You better land it. You see, she needs that pressure. She needs that. Okay, no, don't say that. <laughs> it wasn't even bad what I was gonna say, but you know, context. Hello? Can I be freed from this? Oh, I ended up with mud on my face. Okay, let's get out of here. We and Univa, y'all. You know what? I wanna try something. So, zoom, zoom out. Zoom out. Ah, isn't it weird, y'all? This is like near Johto. This is near Unova. <laughs> like, that's wild. I guess they never technically told us where Kita Kami is, but come on, man. Don't do that, Jo- do 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 If I freaking kill you right now, I'll get so much experience. Get it. Y'all, stop it! This is the- 56? This is the music when you get those double- Excuse me? When you get those double encounter- Look how much XP I need. Freaking 21. Why won't Oki follow me? I thought Pokemon followed you- Oh yeah, you do this! <gasps> what? What? You found Okutaro? That is- Don't do that. Don't you hate this man? Hey, I can fill my Pokedex like this to an extent. Oh yes! Oh, sight there. Oh, these aren't items. What's wrong with that Rhyhorn? What? Yo, it kind of looked like an original variant. It had like a big flap on its head. Yo, the normal Tauroses. By the way, if I get into another chain of battle, they're going to black me out. This is a mate. Stop it. Don't get near me. Who's that? Univin Pokemon. Okay. A Golden Tauros. A Smeargle. Kill it. Kill it, Ogi. Ogi's my favorite Pokemon. I love that Ogre Bond doesn't have a crown, y'all. Think about what that could mean. 
It's 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 like it's wielding its own power, you know? It makes all the other Terrastal Pokemon look so pathetic. Like they all get the same crown and she just got like her own crap. Oh, look at that fly gun. I want to kill it. All right, how do I get to school? It's in the savanna biome, right? I mean, oh, it's in the yeah, the trop this crap. Fine, y'all, I'm going. My heart aches. Excuse me. Bait ass girl. I absolutely will not. Oh. Ice punch? Who that? Dupider? Disgusting. Barboach? Less disgusting. That is dis actually disgusting. You you brought freaking Paldean Pokemon. Whoa! They got both executors here. That's kind of what. Oh, my boy in the hoodie! Stop that! Take this away! That's so stupid. I did not just scream at a Frigoraph. That's not my dog. That's not the homie. Whoa, what it. What is wrong with that Frigoraph? They did not act like that here. Could you imagine the Trastle energy makes these Pokemon a bit more wild? I didn't even know what that was for a second. Y'all y'all all wanna die? I think all of you should die. Do not pick. Does she have a water mask? She does. You know what's cool about the fire mask is that it raises her attack. Like you, there's, there's no other good mask. Once you realize that, an indoor sea, that's so true. Hey! What's going on here? Y'all having picnic? So she drinking like booze? So romantic. Oh, y'all on a date. I won't interrupt. This is the best. Alright, what is he studying? Let's see. What is he studying? Sucker's got a diagram. I can't make it out. Say, Chansey photobombed. Photobombed. Could you imagine she said something? Oh, no. At least it's not Toad School. I... Keep it up. Here goes. Smack me. Smack me if you freaking dare. Smack my face! What the frick is wrong with you? I hate Unova already. What is that? That's the border. Why the border looks so kind of crazy? We're not done, sir. He's the final boss. I'll come back and smack him at the end of the game. This is not the way the map wants me to go. We got Inkays. I'm legit, y'all. I got a legit smile on my face. I'm, I'm pretty proud of Game Freak for this right now. This is nice, man. What's that? Yeah, what are they doing? That was freaking Drift Fail City! I'ma smack Masada! Right now, I'ma smack him! Can I climb this at least? Yo, that, they just mixed Drift... I, I think it's Drift Fail, you know, one of the Univan ones. I thought it was a bunch of enamorouses. I was almost enamored. What the frick is that? You get Smack me too! I dare you! Smack me. All right. Wait, this kind of reminds me of Paul Dia music. All right, I got to heal up freaking Baby Spice. I hate her already. I had the option of giving her Moonblast, but w I want to use her special move. You can only use it in Legends. What's the accuracy on it? it it's legit like 85. It shouldn't be that bad. She missed it three times in a row. That's a 15% chance of- Okay. Alright, here's the teacher from the preview. Oh, Tamo. Whisper, whisper. You don't have any trouble finding this place? <laughs> whisper, whisper. Whisper, whisper. Say again? I didn't quite catch that. Alola, everybody? Are you kidding me? Why you say this? Shall we get started? I am Kukui's cousin. Looks like we have a new face here with us today. I'm sure you're all enjoying the tropical climb we've recreated here in the coastal biome. But remember, it's really different. I mean, it's really for the many Pokemon you'll find living here, adapted for such weather. 
One such species has even grown exceptionally larger than it might in other regions. I wonder who. Thanks to all the light, it's definitely not exposed to here. That's right, certain species of Pokemon can have completely different appearances depending on the region. We call this variation of regional form. This is cool, y'all. And that brings us to today's task. I'd like each of you to show me in Alolan form. It doesn't drop, but it's the music. <laughs> Many of our classes here at Blueberry Academy are practical ones like this. I like it. This is how classes should be. You know how much you would learn going out? Uh, you want me to catch <laughs> at a low form Pokemon? I swear I saw one, didn't I? All right, so all we have to do is stay in this coastal biome and we can find... Oh, freaking Slack King. Yeah, this is so much fun right now. I bet you these Terra Dens might even have them. So, okay, so Terrapagus' energy is not... Br what touched me? This is so wild. Hey, a Picky Peck. Like, so Terrapagus' energy is not breathing like... F okay, so in Paldia, it breathes from the Great Crater. Where would an Alolan executive be? What is that? Uh, okay, it breathes from the Great Crate. Ooh, a cave in, in Paldia. Jump so you don't run into things. And in Kitakami, it's from the Crystal Pool. XP Candy M. Does the music change? Found one. <laughs> what? You no! Get your ass. I was actually hearing if it would do be a lot of music, but it shouldn't be, man. We're in Unova. Level 69. I got quick balls, yo. He's expensive, too. I mean, I want to find that executor, though. Maybe we can't find the executor. You gotta, like, heal. Oh, my God. The sucker's on my team now. I ain't no way I'm using the Diglett. Ooh. More Pokemon. It's Golden Whiskers. I thought we agreed those were hair. It's function as sensors. Look how juicy he looks. Yo, he looked juicy in this game. What? I want to nickname you Juicy. Juicy, yo. That, these colors, they're so nice. Oh, God. Look at all the Pokedex they want me to fail. All right, watch this. Heavy slam. Okay. Yeah, I want to catch... Okay, I mean, we got one, but I want to find that executor. I just want to see an Alolan executor. Why are you doing this? I want to see an Alolan executor roaming around. Oh. Ok Oki's unhappy with this. Okay, so we've heard two Unova... Th three Unova themes now. The ambience in the overworld, the, tr the wild battle, and then the trainer battle. Let's see what... Okay, wait. Executors might be along the coast. Wait, along the palm trees. I'm just gonna give this one shot and then I'm going. Executors. I thought that was one. So wild, y'all. Hey, look, it's these blo- A flying blossom? Blossoms fly? Hey, yo, daddy punked me off. He's right there. All right. I'm going to assume there's no executor. Look how tall that... Is that an executor? Look how tall that golden crap is. I'm about to do a 180 watch. How dare you? How dare you? It'd be really freaky if one of these was an executor. You know what's wild, y'all? Like, where are the other Lolan Pokemon? What if I didn't find that Diglett? Oh, you know what? If I go to the other biomes, they might have different Unova references too. What's this? Frick, I thought this was Zelda for a second. I could go through the, the, the floor. All right, I'm back, y'all. Oh, I could have just flown here. Why buy the DLC to fly, though? Let me in. Let me in class. Let's see this. I did it, Lacey. Do you know what kind of Pokemon you're supposed to be looking for? Wait! Oh, I thought you wanted an Executor. So she told us we can't find one. Did you manage to catch one? Yeah. You're trying to show everyone that I got nothing? Tangling... This dude got Fisher? 
that's one all right you have without a doubt gotten yourself in a lowland diglet it wobbles the metallic whiskers that sprout from its head to communicate with its comrades wait that one you already finished the assignment i was really motivated so battling isn't your only talent then you've got a knack for catching pokemon too it's easy to see how high level the students must be at uva academy nah bro this place looks like they should be more practically capable take me to carmine this guy couldn't connect his hair to his beard we're all out of time for today so that'll have to be it for this class okay i would i would enroll in blueberry y'all look how practical all this is never mind they just mentioned homework <laughs> it's probably like more fun homework though so Thamo, what did you think of your first blueberry class my word so the classes at your academy are even more demanding yeah, they are still. Oh, I was supposed to go make an appearance at the club room. Shoot. I'm afraid this will have to be the end of our little tour. Oh, yeah. Didn't they mention something with the club room? Here at Blueberry, you have we have lots of extracurricular tasks you can do called Blueberry Quests or just BBQs. They're sort of like missions that the school assigns to students out and about in the terrarium. You might be asked to have your Pokemon do some auto battles or catch specific Pokemon. Those sorts of things. You never know what the next BBQ might be. Or what you'll need to do. But if you do, okay, you'll get blue BP. That's great. I want to... Where you go and teach. You know where I want to go to the salon. Blueberry quests uh, are set up by support students. This is a lot of reading. You can check out watch quests by pressing right. You can take up... You can... <laughs> this is too much reading. I can't. I can't do it. I'll try. Blueberry points. I can't. And that's it for me. Sorry for having a dash. But I really must be off now. I read it in my mind. You ready? Watch. What? Damn, why I look at her like that? What the frick? Please be Carmine. <gasps> there she is! Best girl Carmine. BGC. <laughs> hey, this is Tamo's phone, right? It's me, Carmine. She must be so happy. Oh, you know how sad she was at the end of the teal mask. I heard the news. You got picked for a Blueberry Academy's exchange program, right? Uh, yeah. I said no. Nice job. You can't fool me. I've already got solid confirmation you've been enrolled here. Anyway, you should totally come show your face. It's been too long already. I'm coming. Have you been to the terrarium? There's a special... There's a space called Central Plaza. Yes! This game knows exactly. This game's got my attention peaked. Let's go. Okay, so this to the central, right? Stop it! Are you guys actually flying? I have no idea they fly. This will teach you to not touch me again. Damn, Ogre Punchill! That was your cousin. I like this dude. No baby spice. This freaking diglet about to steal experience and level up. Ooh, comfy? Is that a shiny comfy? Alright. Yeah, they, she said you can find an Alolan Executor. So, Central Plaza. I'm so happy, y'all. So, here's the next... Uh, ooh, who's that? Here's the next thing that's gonna pop up. Where is Kieran? Where's our... But where's your little brother, evil man? World-ending demon. Man, I wanted to go to the... Oh, I gotta go this way. I wanted to fix my hair, man. Look at me. I look like the like a Lego piece. I don't know where that would be. It might be in the central plaza. I didn't see any at the top. Oh yeah, blueberry quest, right? If I push this button. Defeat 10 Pokemon using auto battle. Hey yo, say less. Go, Ogi. I can do that easy. Alright, we got a Surviper. I got Deerling Hair. Yeah, this is a brutal Pokemon game, man. I got punked off by a tiny Xerneas. This is a brutal Pokemon game because, like, we, we killing Pokemon out here. Like, think about it. Let's see what we get right now. Trap Pinch Shell. You think that Trap Pinch is still alive if I just did that? Um, okay. Let's kill a couple more. Ogi, kill the Chansey. Are you kidding me, Chansey? Chansey, you're not escaping this. Get it, Ogi. <gasps> the Chansey escaped? No! We killing this Chansey! <laughs> Yo! Why did Ogre Pot have to do it like that? Water Terra Shard. Let's look for these Stella Terra Shards, y'all. How many have I gotten? 
Uh, only six? Dude, I swear I just did 20. Don't get the item. Uh, sandstorm. What in the frick is that? Bro, that's like a volibee nest. Okay, we're like at eight. Everstone? Did you just kill a freaking happy D? Uh, Ogi? Can you kill two more, please? A do duo down? Like a freaking phoenix feather? <laughs> a do duo down, y'all. Okay, there we go. Now I've completed it. And now they want me to catch a wild Pokemon. I'll, I'll catch something I'm interested in. Uh, take a photo of a wild Pokemon that is swimming. Hey, you know, this is not bad. This is kind of, uh, the kind of quests that are a bit interesting to do. Like, you know, the, the kind of like an Animal Crossing. Yeah, I ain't talking to you, bro. I know exactly who you are. You know, in Animal Crossing, they got some fun mini quests. Especially if I can use these blueberry points for something good. Let's see, what's something worth what? I want to catch something. Wait, I'm getting away from the water, though. Is there any water? Oh my god, I, I want to do this. Nah, we got to get this photo. Is it up there? What the frick? Where this water at? Is there water there? Alright, we might have to save the water one for after. Let's go this way. So yeah, the last time we saw Kieran, at least our... Oh, look at this place! Central Plaza! <gasps> ah, Porygon? So round and squeaky smooth. Hey, Okay. Mumu Milk? Hey, you know, I'll just buy a bunch of these. This is for, like, auto-healing. You can use these. So I'll take those. And then I'll take Quick Balls. I have a bunch. We'll save that. Uh, what else can I get? Are you kidding me? What is this crap for? Yeah, I haven't cooked once in my life. A Proscorito? A Club Stick? Oh, a cloth. I thought it said, uh, Lechonk. Smoked fillet. Yeah, these are freaking Pokemon. <laughs> VV pick. Okay. We're, we're eating Pokemon out here, yo. Yo, Pokemon, you accidentally get in dark. No seconds for me, please. She ate too much. The Elite Four is so strong. Lacey got me good. Smart strike. Jumping down. Hi, guys. I need a good date spot. Okay, Pokemon's totally into dating now. They used to hide that crap. See you later. You ain't seen them now. What am I hearing right now? I know this music from somewhere. My phone's almost dead. Where? Oh, it's the route music. It's like route two music or something in Unova. Hey, maybe I should. What the frick? Get it in the water fast! The canyon biome's through here. There's a lot of rocky rough surfaces, so you might want to ride on a Pokemon. Okay, are you gonna ride on your Dugong? Why everyone ride? Is this water? Suddenly it's snowing here. Alright, where is Carmine? Could you imagine you just like sitting... So a Ditto Block? Where'd you guys see the Ditto Block? Where? Yeah, I gotta take photos of the Ditto Blocks. Y'all, this DLC is like mad fun right now. I don't even know why. Is that Carmine? Carmine has been so long, I almost don't recognize you. The blocks. The blocks is here on the Trarium. Give off infrared and ultraviolet rays. This is the freaking first time that they're mentioning it. That's Scarlet. Infrared is Scarlet and ultraviolet is violet. It's Apparently, these rays help plants grow. I don't even think he means it as the game versions, but that's the first time they've mentioned it. Like, think about it, y'all. Why are these called Pokemon Scarlet Violet? You would think in Pokemon Shoes, that's Garbine! You would think in Pokemon Shoes, they would get more sales. <laughs> this is so cool, dude. There she is. That they would get more sales calling these games Pokemon Past and Future. The Synchro Machine. I want to change my clothes. Finally, I can rest in peace. Lady, I want to change... Who's that? I just talked to you! Oh, I can't believe I fell. Can I please climb the wooden blocks? Oh, I could just freaking Mario. Okay. The game's slowly introducing us to the Elite Four too. Good. 
Well done, dude. They're not giving you too much info at once. Like, I'm not confused at all. So, yeah, things are a bit rough right now. She's talking about Kieran, guys. I couldn't agree more. Well, maybe she's not. Wow, well, you don't know anything about Kieran. Ah, uh, you have a visitor, Carmine. So she does have friends here. I guess she just really felt connected to us in, in the in Kitakami. I can't understand why. Uh, long time no see, Tamil. I bet you miss me, huh? Nope. I did a lot. What? <laughs> See, like, she got the dead eyes too, but it doesn't mean anything. It, it's just it's just comedic. Did your wonderful memories of me all wither away since we last saw each other? Time for me to go. You, you don't got any plans. You're just trying to be cool. Who shaved a plus in her head? That's one of my classmates. She's an interesting one. Hmm, speaking of classmates, it feels kind of weird seeing you here at my school. Yeah, I'm playing the Indigo Disc. And look at you, you haven't changed at all since we last met. As for me, well, I've been helping Miss Briar with their research. Are you freaking kidding me? What do you mean you've been to all sorts of different regions? Briar's only researching terrestrial regions. What, this phenomenon's in a bunch of places? Nah, nah, it must not be uh, like terrestrial regions. It made my Pokemon a lot stronger than when we battled last. Hey, you want to see? Oh, you totally want to see. Well, we have a battle card right here, so get in a position. Okay, let's go. Carmen, can you just do my hair? Do I have to go to a salon? Let me get hair like hers. Those, those, that two-tone crap is so cool. Okay, you ready for a double battle? Yeah, I've only got two Pokemon. It's her theme. All right, let's see what you got. Okay. What kind of trainer even... Okay, I can fight these. I can fight these. Do not... I'll give you a special treat since you came all this way. Get ready to eat Terrarium Dirt. Okay, what level? Oh, hey, okay. Hey, I'm unlocking all the dialogue, man. Let's go. Hey, now I have to trust a lot. I should have made myself a freaking physical. Okay, we're gonna trust lies. We're gonna Ivy Cudgel the Tool Cannon. And we're gonna miss Spring Tide Storm. Do I flinch when I try? I can terrestrialize without flinching? Everyone else flinches when they terrestrialize. What's that mean? Okay, my, my attack's neutralized again. Whoa. What's that? Oh, it's trying to use Beak Blast. Okay. I'm going to get burnt. But because I'm a fire type, I won't. Hey, stop that. Why don't you use one of those not very effective moves sometimes? It's interesting, y'all. Carmine's clearly an important character, right? More important than the other Elite Four, which is cool. Also, isn't it kind of cool, yeah? When you're using a move on your trash light, it's especially when you're holding the control, you can like feel it absorbing from the mask, from the crown or the mask. So it makes you wonder. Like you can literally feel the double stab. Okay, here's our Sinistra. What is Sinistra again? Grass Ghost? Yo, you raising the wrong attack again. All right, we gonna Spring Tide Storm? This, this crafty fort. That's where I'm ready to go all up. Oh, damn. Wow, is she trustlizing without an orb? Wait, she never trustlizing in Kitakami, did she? I can't even remember. I just played and I can't remember. I don't think she did. Arvin, come get your daddy's invention. These suckers are using it. Okay, Sinistra's attack fell. Look at that Sinistra with plants growing out of it. It looks weird. Oh, goodness. This dude is gonna evolve. Does that Sinistra get heat proof or something? I'm not sure. It's a weird ability, though. Okay, I think we beat her. Her signature is Sinistra. Yeah, this she terrestrializes. This is her last Pokemon. The <laughs> freaking the crown. The, I mean, you couldn't see the crown properly in that. The next time someone terrestrializes, we'll talk about that crown. 
like the face that appears on the crown that did not go the way I had planned Frick I'm so hype y'all Yo I've been up for like freaking 30 hours <laughs> So I said listen y'all I set a one hour alarm Because I thought this game came out at 8 a.m. It turns out it comes out at 8 p.m. So you know the meme of the dude who's just like waiting around on the beach looking out the window That was me because if I go back to sleep, I'll be- I'll wake up in 82 hours. So I have to stay up. Frick, man. Go. Go. Stop. You're getting off the party right now. So I'm like both tired, but freaking so hyped at the same time. Ah. I got so much stronger once I could terrestrialize my Pokemon, but you just had to go and get even stronger, didn't you? You still don't hold back in battles, huh? Another thing hasn't changed a bit. Hey, by the way, have you uh, run into Kiki yet? Uh, no, I haven't. Can you do my hair, please? Oh, never mind. If you haven't seen him yet, it's fine. Wow, he's walking around with his hair tied. Are you kidding me? What? Was this assignment too hard for you, too? Wait, that's... <gasps> the sucker! Why is he like that? Grr! Why is he doing that? Why? <laughs> he's... He's even got a theme that this sucker need. He legit? Bro, the whole teal mask he was still carrying. This sucker legit look possessed now. That don't happen to you overnight. Okay, I'll stop. I knew it. That's Karen. Phew, you almost saw us. This is what she means. She doesn't... She wants us to hide from him. Y'all, they should have hit Kieran's freaking face from the trailer. He's just like gonna... He's gonna Ezio stab me. Oh, uh, that's Kieran. Shh, keep your voice down. Look at this, man. I thought I told you to train five Pokemon to battle with. S sorry. Things have been really hectic to get home this month. Oh, got it. So that means you're just okay being this week forever? That's what I'm hearing? N no, I... Well, since you're so busy, I'll go ahead and do your favor. PUNCH HIM! I'll write your resignation from the club for you. Man, you a bully! I don't need people in my club who don't take it seriously. I'm joining your club! I'm gonna join his club! But wait, Kieran, I'm sorry, give me another chance. That looked so deep until he said, You're, I'm taking you out of my club. <laughs> then it got tame again. <laughs> we talking about clubs out here? Not what you're expecting, right? Kiki looks different, acts different. Okay, he's freaking possessed. The moment he scratched his hair at the ending of the teal mask and he tied his hair, that was like he sealed his transformation. Because, y'all, when you consumed with anger, you don't become that. You be, you, you, you're still yourself. He hasn't been the same since we got back from the school trip. Well, someone needs to punch him in the face. You know that would work. I I'm kidding. Well, that was painful to watch. It would work. Irk. Like, I, I love punch. I I'm, I'm kidding. If it isn't Carmine and Carmine's new mystery friend. What's happened to his hair? Oh, we're just looking at him from a weird angle. <laughs> I don't recognize any Unova in this. Watch, this sucker about to be like Jaden, my my big brother. <laughs> I mean, his grandpa. I think I might have heard of you, though. Are you that new kid from the wild backstory? What a lovely surprise. Just the annoying bozo I didn't want to run into. It's nice to meet your friends. Come on now, at least introduce me. This is Jaden, and he's the worst. <laughs> he's the strongest... He was the champion! I called it, y'all! It's the Lance situation again. He was the champion. He was the strongest trainer at Blueberry Academy. Well, at least he was. Wow, Kieran slapped his face. Beautiful intro, thanks. <laughs> this is Tamo. He's uh, here on a foreign exchange program. He's my friend, and... What about Kieran? You friends with the guy? 
you you're not actually mad at Kieran, right? Because like he beat because he looks like he beat you fair and square. <laughs> yeah, we're friends. Let's piss him off. Oh, I see. That's great. All right, that. I want him to be pissed. So they're hinting Kieran beat him. Y'all, the trailer showed too much. <laughs> All right, Dama, how about I show you our club room? Huh? Why do you need to do that? You haven't joined any of the clubs we've got here, right? Take it from me. You'll have a way better time here if you join one. We'd love to have such an interesting new member. In fact, we'd better call Dibs now. No, I want to join Carmine's. No. No, Tupac. Yo, he, he looks like a... Ch I'm so happy he was champion. Hey, hold on. Gosh, see, I told you he was the worst. Look at him. Just assuming we'll go along with whatever. I'm going with you. Yo, that Karen crap got me shocked. He legit... Nah, he's possessed. <laughs> Obviously, you could find alternate explanations, but dude, that's some deep anger. So, okay, I will say one thing after this. And here we are. Hey, are you sure this is a good idea? You know, cuz... Cuz of Kieran? Nah, don't worry. He won't show up in your tent. We hiding from him? Leg I'm not scared of him! Why would I be scared? How are you scared of him? You know why she, You know what it means that everyone's scared of him? It's that's how distant he is from the Kieran they know. Which means he's like possessed. I can't believe it. This is actually happening. Cuz of Kieran? Nah, don't worry. He won't show up here anytime soon. She actually wants us to hide, if you say so. Is that a golden go drawn? A Pikachu. Anyway, this is the base of operations for the League Club. Oh, no, that's a Suda Widow. On behalf of the club, whole club, glad you're here. Oh, the League Club. Oh, so this is their Elite Four Super. What was Kieran's club? What's this League Club? Hey, <laughs> glad you asked. We Blueberry Academy students have our own Pokemon battle ranking system, the Blueberry League. Here in the League Club, we battle each other to train up so we can climb the ranks. We win, we lose, we have a good old rowdy time. Such as our humble club in a nutshell. I like this guy, he doesn't care that he lost. You're not wrong, but seriously, that's how you explain it to new people? Yup. Though I guess we're having less of a good old rowdy time than usual lately. I'm a member of the club too. I don't show up to the club room very much though. Just FYI. The top four Pokemon trainers in the Blueberry League are called the Blueberry League Elite Four. Well, what about number actual one? And this annoying toothpaste haired bozo is one of them. So is that girl you saw with me at the terrarium earlier. Yo, look! <laughs> Put bottles on the left and berries on the right. Too bad you didn't make the cut, Carmine. Can she be like number five or something? I've just been too busy with extracurricular stuff. Haven't had time for league matches. Yo, she been going to regions. That's much more cooler. If we're talking actual school, I'm way above any of the elite four. <laughs> what do you mean? That's no lie. He he's just too carefree. What you think, Damo? Fun club, huh? I like this guy. What? Pokemon, you got some personality in your characters all of a sudden. Uh, no. Let's see if I can piss him off. I have a feeling you're more into the idea than you're letting on. I like this guy! <laughs> anyway, that I think that takes care of it. You're in. On a trial basis. Huh? What do you mean trial basis? You heard me. Far as the Draster's concerned. Of course he talks like this. We're clubmates now. Trial basis clubmates. So now you can use this club room freely and do whatever with the stuff here. Check out the computer over there too. It's super helpful. Damn, that's the lowest quality logo. He might have seen us. Is that a Porygon Z? He might have seen us battling Carmine. Yeah, see, looking at these balls, like what? Remember the Master Ball crap? Something suspicious about a Master Ball in this DLC. I don't know what. It, it, it lets you use your BP to support kids in other clubs. I don't want to support them. What? I don't want to support anyone. Here, give it a shot. You'll see what I mean. Who your daddy? Wouldn't it be cooler if he isn't related to anyone in Unova? But he looks too much like it. Try sending that to Mitch in Baseball Club. What is going on? He can help out with your throwing form. 
Yo, what's going on here? Frick, yo, I gotta end the episode, man. We just met it. What's this? Some Japanese? Yo, I'm gonna end it here. Make sure I'll shank that like button. Listen, yo, it's the first episode. Give me as many likes as possible and listen. Y'all keep liking it and I'll finish this whole game in like 10 hours and have it up. Y'all just gotta keep liking. Okay, there are so many mysteries to unfold in this, y'all. We just met Kieran and this sucker is possessed. This sucker is Tokutaro in some way and we're gonna figure it out. But I did not expect him to have that serious a change. So we gonna uncover these things, man. And just remember, y'all, at the end of this DLC... The big Tropicus battle, everything, it's right in our freaking hands. So shank that like button, y'all. I'll see you on the next one. Let's go, baby. Take care.